Hi, I'm Oliver Thacker from Prosperity Wealth and Development, and I'm here at Broadoak Stanham Market to provide you with your Q2 update. Today I'm going to be talking to James, who's going to give us a detailed update on the construction here at Broadoaks. Yes, uh, as you can see at the moment, obviously we're erecting timber frames. Obviously we've got several plots up with timber frame now, around 11 units. Uh, we're currently working in plot 7 where we're standing, doing the first fix carpentry and first fix plumbing. Then we'll follow off with uh, first fix electrical. And then obviously we'll start plastering within the next week or so. Most of the properties will be built in the same procedure. Uh, and then obviously once this, this, this stage is done, obviously we'll brick up the fronts and sides and uh, and over the block. Brilliant, so thank you very much. And um, and after all this part's done, what's the next steps? The next steps is obviously to get the brickwork complete, drop the scaffolding down, and then start doing the external works, i.e. put driveways in, landscape and footpaths, finish the roads, uh, ready to move, obviously build a garage and then ready to move people in. So with, um, with regards to the first, um, the first people being able to move in, when do you anticipate that will be happening? We're looking to get the first people occup occupied properties sort of late September this year. Okay. Uh, obviously before we do that, well, obviously we've got a couple of properties to build, to build next door to that, which are obviously not in the phase we're building, but we need to get them complete, ready to, for them to move in. So James, obviously without the uh, great British weather, has there been any um, any other challenges that we've had to overcome or, or anything that we've faced that we've had to kind of work around? Uh, nothing sort of weather, weather predicted issues. Uh, we have had a couple of issues where we have obviously got underfloor heating on uh, most of the properties. Uh, with the underfloor heating, we have to then get the uh, timber frame up, windows in, prep the floors and then concrete rather than concrete before you put the timber frame up. Yeah. But uh, that's, you know, it's been a bit of a slow process, but we're there now. Uh, everything's going well and uh, it's an issue we've overcame. So James, with this being a, a phase completion, obviously there's, there's different parts happening uh, uh, all the time. So you've got kind of different buildings at, at different phases. Could you give us a bit of an insight on what's going on behind us here? Yeah, at the moment, obviously, we're still in phase one. Plots 208, 209 at the rear, as you, as you can see behind us, they're uh, being erected scaffolding, ready to lift the timber frame in on Monday. Okay. Uh, once the timber frame is lifted in, they'll then obviously put the roof on. And as, obviously, once the scaffold has finished that section, they'll move on to the next section and then do the next plot with scaffolding and stay in front of the timber frame team. Oh, brilliant. So the, the site's just going to chase itself round? Just flat, yeah, the site will just flow round. Obviously, the scaffold is groundwork is timber frame. Once the timber frame's up, the roof will be done, windows will go in and start working inside. And I'm assuming when you're doing that, you'll then have to start thinking about kind of bringing people into site to start living, so you'll be working kind of away from them. Yeah, the plan is obviously as we build, we move away. So when we're moving people in, we're sort of construction away from them, so there's no health and safety issues, yeah. um, no damage to anybody's vehicles or anything while we're trying to work. Yeah. So as you can see around me, the weather's turned in on us and, uh, and it's starting to rain again. So um, we're going to wrap this one up from, uh, from a Q2 2024 update. Thanks very much for watching and I look forward to seeing you in quarter three um, with some houses ready to deliver.